You know, I've uh, I've said it more than once. I've actually felt it, reckoned with it more than once. That uh, certainly I've become a far more textured, complexioned poet than I was forty years ago. And for all that, I'm not sure that I'm a better poet than I was forty years ago. The poem is called uh, Gabriel. Uh, its setting is a, uh, uh, a town in Switzerland I visited in the early 70s. Hmm. Gabriel. We crossed a wooden bridge that last night, not much thinking about what could have crossed before us. Then we slowly stepped along the rotten rock wall of a rampart, never really worrying about the enemy still crouched inside the slack tide hour. Then she suddenly took my hand, and we climbed up the cliff's old face to where we reached the rise to where she said she'd heard of a secret castle's warm place, to where her Swiss knight's swoon was a silver spoon, to where she felt as free to herself as a runaway stream spilling out between us. Then we had to climb back down, and we never stopped walking through the closed up town, or not until my train came in, not until machinery of waking steps broke our small line of movement, not until she said goodbye, since she didn't want to tear up when the train was on time. That's my poem. <laughs>